Right, we begin on this sad note. Uh, the Natal Premier Sitla Sigalala says that uh, preliminary investigations have revealed that the vehicle in which 13 members of the Mdali family were killed a week ago was not registered as a taxi. Uh, the crash occurred between Underberg and Bulver near the southern Drakensberg. Sigalala was speaking at a mass funeral service at Kilman near Underberg. This is a tragedy. It is quite a very painful moment for the family, but for the community of this area. As the government were here to hold them, to be with them and support them to navigate through this difficult time. A premier, of course, an accident like this, it's always answers. You know, people want answers. The families would want a closure as to exactly uh, what happened. All we knew uh, throughout the week when the accident happened was that the driver said to have lost control. We know that the Department of Transport officials uh, were conducting an investigation. Is there anything new uh, that you're able to tell us? How far has the investigation gone? The investigation is continuing, but we want to report that what we have established is that this was not a registered taxi. And then Therefore, it was not part of any association or transporting communities, but it was transporting the family, family members. It is difficult to say what happened because most of the people who were inside the, the, the taxi itself uh, passed on, but and the driver himself died. So we are faced with that, but the investigation is ongoing. Certainly that must be concerning, Premier, because even in the past we've had incidents where, and I know through the Department of Transport and yourselves, as the government have always cautioned members of the public to ensure that if they are going to be travelling, they try to go through uh, you know, the taxi associations, mm. check that the vehicles are licensed and that the vehicles are, are in order. Yes, the vehicles was not licensed and one, that is one of the problems. Since uh, the country entered level one, we have had 77 car accidents in KwaZulu Natal as a whole, and they have cost 106 lives. This is terrible, and that's why we are saying, out of this tragedy, let us learn, let us be responsible in whatever, uh, wherever we are, and try whilst we are driving. The parents of a 17-year-old boy. From